Welcome back, everyone, to Let's Play Silent Hunter 4, Wolves of the Pacific. Now, our last career here did not end very well. We will be starting a new career. Um, we're going to set it up the same way in Asiatic Fleet, Sargo class. I'll be changing difficulty again once we get inside. 2,000 now. Um, I'm not sure if you guys remember the our Ghost Patrol, Patrol Zero. If you haven't watched that, I suggest you go ahead and do so, because in a few seconds I'm about to give spoilers. Okay. You probably, if you wanted to go see the Ghost Patrol, you've probably already seen it. Went to see it by now. So, basically what happened was, ultimately what crashed the game was we were in a port in, in, in near Indochina and a convoy spawned inside near the port. It did and it didn't. We saw the ghost destroyer shoot at us, the ghost Asi Shio class destroyer. Which I want to go ahead and say was the ghost of that of the destroyer we sunk, which was an Aussie Sh Shio class. So its ghost traveled over 9,000 kilometers to attempt to kill us, and bugged out our game in the process. So we are going to go with the easy and we are going to avoid going over to Indochina at the beginning of the war. Our goal is if we can get to get through our first patrol then we won't have a ghost patrol again. I'm not sure if I'm gonna upload, if we have an uh, upload the patrol, if we have another ghost patrol. I thought it was funny the first time. Also because we had a circle run, and I never had a circle run before. So I got to demonstrate just how poor uh, the Mark 14 co torpedo can be. Also, I'm going to attempt to record that opening cutscene. Uh, not the opening cutscene to the game, the opening cutscene to the campaign. I already tried recording the opening cutscene to the game, and Bandicam won't have it. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna cut the loading screen, I'll see you in a second. I forgot about this part again. We've been assigned the Sea Raven again, so all is good. We have to report to Cavity Naval Base, or Caviet Naval Base, Manila, Philippines, no later than December 9, 1941. So I'm going to attempt to record this uh, next cutscene, and uh, I'll let you guys watch it. If it doesn't work out, uh, then I won't record those in the future. Gentlemen, as you already know, we are at war. I quote the President of the United States. Yesterday, December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy, the United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. The attack has effectively eliminated our entire battleship force for the time being. As a consolation, it has failed to catch any of our aircraft carriers in port, while the submarines and fuel reserves have escaped unharmed. During the past years, the Japanese military was engaged in a seemingly endless war against China, badly needing oil and other raw materials. Since we halted the trade with Japan, they schemed to seize the oil and mineral-rich East Indies and Southeast Asia. A Japanese attack into the Indies, Malaya, and the Philippines was expected, and plans prepared for it. But obviously, we have not prepared enough for an attack of this magnitude. The attack against Malaya has materialized yesterday, and last night, the Japanese forces also attacked Hong Kong, Guam, the Philippines, and Wake Island. This morning, the Japanese continued with an attack on Midway. The Japanese offensive is extending throughout the Pacific, with a submarine force left mostly to itself. We need to act accordingly. For the time being, we will conduct operations as follows. Boats based in Pearl Harbor will patrol in Japanese home waters and also reconnoiter the Marshall Islands as it's presumed that Japanese forces are massing in that archipelago for a second attack on our bases. Manila-based boats will deploy to guard the vital island of Luzon against approach by enemy forces. 
Individual patrol orders will be received from your commander. December 9, 1941. Gavial Naval Base, Manila, Philippines. Now, that little cutscene, if you will, um, uh, kind of spoils for us uh, where that Kido Butai that attacked Pearl Harbor, Pearl Harbor is going. Uh, they will stay on the map, supposedly, at least until the 17th of December, so if you're deploying from uh, Pearl Harbor or even Asiatic Fleet, if you can get past everything, you could, in theory, uh, attack the Kido Butai that attack Pearl Harbor. Uh, anyway, I thought that was an interesting thought. I'm gonna go check to see how well that recorded. I'll be right back. It seemed to record okay. Also, through watching the footage, that out there is clearly a cruiser or a battleship. I mean, there's a turret right there. Big turret. Anyway. Uh, let's look at our sub. I'm assuming you guys have all either played or seen Silent Hunter 4, or at least in my Ghost Patrol, or so I'm gonna refer to it as the Ghost Patrol, or the Tutorial Patrol. Anyway, you could be better. You definitely could be better. Who's got better leadership? Oh, you've got much better leadership. Swapping you out for that guy. Tricky cow, caliber, death now. Done, we're gonna have to remedy that. I'm gonna get a 4 inch 50 caliber uh, bow mounted deck gun. Can't wait till we can get a 5 inch twin mount deck gun. That was amazing. We will grab our standard equipment, leaving us with a thousand right now. Mark 14 torpedoes, we know how awful they can be. Now let's look at Do I have two for me? Oh wait a second. Oh yeah, I got my gun crew got kicked off because I got a deck. Eli Howard and Tucker B. McClinic Talk. McClinic? McClinoak? I don't know how to pronounce that. You two will be my deck gun operator. I have too many videos. Yeah. Well, let's sort them by skill. Balanced, actually. Huh. Better than this watch. We got to 
Oh wow. One thirteen watchmen. Chief Petty Officers. Or officers and Petty Officers. Well, that guy's a Chief Petty Officer. Oh, so yeah, we got four extra dudes to rotate as I see fit. Uh, those four guys are in damage control. Hopefully you guys on the deck gun won't try to mount, or uh, won't, won't man the deck gun under water. Yeah, I've got no promotion. Uh, next is our realism settings. Now, I made a mistake last time in our realism settings here. I'm supposed to leave that checked. That's why, uh... Realism, I thought it was supposed to be like 74. Oh no, we want all that. We want that. There we go. 74. That's what I'm used to. It. Last time we had a 67. That's what we want. This is what I've always played with. 74 reels. We will apply set changes. Now, I'm going to quickly go make a save. And then we'll go get our first control. Okay, save me. I think we are ready to get our first patrol. Oh, we get the same mission as last time, too? Patrol off the Philippines. Oh no, it's patrol instead of... I'm supposed to patrol off the Philippines instead of deploy. So it is a different mission, it's just in the same spot. We will deploy outside the harbor. Oh, I was supposed to turn this off for the loading screen. Hopefully it doesn't screw with it. Please. Yes, sir. Okay, it didn't crash the game. Yes, sir. Well, you guys got to see the loading screen. I hope that loading screen wasn't the thing to come, because that was a big fleet.
So, what's our plan for this patrol? Well, we know that the Kido Butai is up here, and on the 17th of December, it'll approximately be in this area. It is the 10th of December. Even if I run ahead and flank, I don't think I'll make it. I don't think I can get that far enough. If I deployed from Pearl Harbor, I might be able to get there. I actually probably could catch them by midway if I ran ahead and flank. But they would want me to fly over here Where is the Where's the base? had a chug, so I'm scanning the, uh, the sonar, seeing if I can hear anything. Yes. Something to the east. That's very quiet. Contact! Warship! Constant distance. Bearing. Two. Five. Seven. Long range. It's over there. We are underwater right now because we've got a buzz of like planes. It's always, by the way, it's always safer to mark it as a warship. We don't know what it is. Let's check the periscope up so you can see if there's a plane. Just hover on this. It says warship because I marked it in as a warship. That sounds really small though. But it's also far away. I'm gonna give the order to surface the boat so we can pick up some speed. He doesn't sound like he's going that fast, so we can probably catch him. It would not surprise me, by the way, if that guy is free. Sped up a little bit, sped up time. Let's see if I can still hear him. Ooh, there's more than one there. Contact! Warship! Moving away! Bearing! Three, two, nine, oh, long range! Away. Contact! 
Warship, moving away. Bearing, three, two, nine. Long range. Speed. Let's pick up our speed. Although that's going to make a lot more yes. noise. Yeah, the stable eyes you though, that won't apply to my external camera. My external camera will not be bouncing around because of my silver either. That would be kind of awkward. Yeah. But it's like I said before, there was a good chance that they were friendly. Yeah. Those look like Liberty ships to me. That first one's a little ship, that one's a small cargo. Yep. I'll show you. I 
anything has more five inch turrets than a, a more five inch turrets than a destroyer. Anyway. Uh I guess next time you'll see me is if we find something we can shoot at or we're at the end of the uh, patrol grid. Well, we're at the end of the patrol grid. I just followed my course down. Uh, we just now lost the uh, our friendly convoy, so it hasn't been that. Uh, so, what do we do from here? Which fuel do we use? We've used 4% fuel. I'm tempted to go back to Manila just to refuel. Where do we go from there? We're gonna go north. Because we've got a task force coming in. They're probably headed over here. I know from at the beginning of the war, avoid Saigon. Everything that you do, avoid Saigon at the beginning of the war. Go get shot at by ghost destroyers. So, uh, I'm gonna figure out what I wanna do. I might ask for a new mission, uh, and I'll let you know what happens. Okay, we just got a new mission to patrol the Luzon Strait, which is where I was going, so... I guess command degrees with where I wanted to go. Um, we're gonna go resupply at Manila first. Just because I want that extra fuel. Then we're gonna head to the north. I'm sure there isn't an island there. Actually, we're gonna scoop a little further out.